What's up, my friend? Welcome to Monday, August 16th, 2021. There'll never be another August 16th, 2021. So state your claim, gangster. Get out here and live your life, right? So here's the thing, I got a great message for you today, right? Great message. But first I got a question for you, right? Have you ever been in a situation where you really, really wanted something, right? And you were willing to do what it took to get it. So you made your mind up on this date, I'm gonna do this, whether run this marathon, whether take this trip, whether do whatever to get whatever you wanted, right? Then that day finally comes and you go out and you do what's needed to get it and you finally get the reward, right? And it's like, this is it? I did all that work, I spent all that time for this? It's a big disappointment, right? Has that ever happened to you? Right? It's happened to me countless times. And then I realized that I needed to do this thing. I needed to create my own criteria. Regardless of what the world or what the powers to be expect of me, I create my own criteria so I could put myself in the best position for success, right? So I'm encouraging you, whatever you're going for, whatever, whatever the reward is, always have your own criteria of what success is to you. So that way, you always be able to reward yourself, my friend. Absolutely, and I'm talking about reward yourself for each and every time you've attempted or accomplished anything. You deserve it, reward yourself, right? But be careful, let me caution you. Be certain that the reward is truly for you, right? And not just to show off to the people what you've done, right? Because if you're trying to show off to the people what you've done, see, here's what'll happen. See, otherwise, if you show enough for the people and the people don't give you the response that you expected, guess what that'll do? It will turn your reward into a punishment. That's what will happen, right? And let me give you another caution, right? Be certain that the level of reward matches the level of accomplishment. Otherwise, it could be damaging effects, my friend. Yup, and here's three strategies that can help you, right? Number one, see positive reinforcement. That's just another word for rewarding yourself. You positively reinforce yourself for the good things you've done so that you can continue to do the good things, right? So positive reinforcement, right? It will keep your internal engine revved up, rum rum, <laughs> even if you're not driving to complete a task. That's important, my friend. Yep. And number two, see, positive reinforcement is most effective, right? When implemented fairly. Like I said earlier, the level of reward has to match the level of accomplishment. Otherwise, it can lead to an entitlement mindset. Nobody wants that, right? And number three, you got to develop a greatness mindset, a mind bold enough to believe right that when you reward yourself it's the constant reminder that the game of life is not over my friend until you until you win yep see the way i've done in my life i got a lot of criteria for my life so i can put myself in the best possible position you know so i'm always going to create my own criteria even if the criteria it may not it may not always be more difficult than the criteria that's expected of the powers to be, but it's always gonna be my own criteria because no one knows you better than you. So whatever's expected of you, always have your own criteria so that you can still put yourself in position for success. Like me in my life, I don't lose. I always win because I take the time to create the right foundation to put myself in to ensure success. I might not be successful to you, 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 but I'm successful to me and the power of God is upon my life, just like it's upon your life. So never forget my friend, you were born to be great.